Maze Arcade video game Dig Dug was developed by Namco, the maker of Pac-Man, and was distributed in the United States in 1982. The purpose of the game is to help your player Dig Dug to destroy his enemies the Pukas, which are the red tomato, looking creatures and the Frigers the green fire, breathing dragons. We will be looking at some of the various gaming systems based on Dig Dug. The first gaming unit we will discuss is the actual arcade game from Namco Atari. The cab is around 6 feet tall with a unique cabinet design. The artwork is very bright, almost pastel-like with the characters from the game coming toward you. The lip marquee features the same artwork and includes an Atari logo as the game was distributed by Atari. The control panel is brightly colored with a joystick in the middle and two pump buttons on each side of the joystick to make it easier for both left and right-handed players. Detailed instructions are to the right as to how to play. On the left are volcano buttons for one or two players. The smaller cabaret unit meant for smaller places and home use has a different build look to it. The next units for discussion are the ones produced by Arcade One. Let's start with the countercades. The countercades are tabletop mini cabinets that replicate the look of the real deal. Just like the original, there are two pump buttons located on either side of the joystick. Unfortunately, the detailed instructions on the right hand side are missing due to the small size of the cab. Since this is a smaller unit, there isn't a coin door. The volume needed a little fixing as it has only three volume settings, loud, extremely loud, and off. The unit also comes with an additional game, Dig Dug 2. For a while, it looked like the countercade was going to be the only representation visually of a replicated arcade cabinet. But a few years later, Arcade 1UP released their Dig Dug Legacy Cabinet. Thus is a 4-foot cabinet that looks more like the actual arcade cabinet and includes more than just two games. You can buy a riser if you want to stand up to play the game. The volume control has been improved as well. Unlike the earlier counter cave, the legacy cabinet has a lit marquee. Also, the playing push buttons have been replaced by the more accurate volcano one or two player buttons. The directions have returned to the right side of the cabinet. There is a coin door to give a better feel to the game. Handhelds have been around since the 70s. A few companies have released a Dig Dug handheld games. Companies such as Super Impulse, Basic Fun, and My Arcade have made smaller, less expensive mini arcades. The Dig Dug arcade game is such a fan favorite that it even appeared on Stranger Things. We are now going to take a break, and we will be right back. Phil's Arcade, located at the Community Rec Center here in Maslin, has all the games that you would ever want to play, from Pac-Man to Defender. Check out our latest games like Galaxian, Galega, Burger Time, Mappy, and this newest one called the Namco Museum, bigger than the rest and has over 10 games, as well as our sit-down cocktail table for those who like to take a rest in game. My name is Phil and I will see you at Phil's Arcade located right here in the Community Plaza in Massillon at the Rec Center. It's Phil's Arcade right at the Community Center in Massillon. Let's take a look at a Pac-Man replica cabinet inside a waiting room and a Ms. Pac-Man replica inside a store.
has a deal for you. Get your youngster a free Billy Bob's Lunch Club card. Come into Showbiz for lunch and ask for a free membership card which entitles your child to ride all the kiddie rides free. With a food purchase, you'll receive a free salad. And our 50-cent ice cream cones are only 10 cents. Mom, you can watch your favorite soaps on our widescreen TV while we entertain your kids with rides, video games, music by Rockfire Explosion, and the best doggone pizza in town. Showbiz Pizza Place in the Evelyn Hills Shopping Center, Fayetteville. This token can unlock a fantasy you'll never forget. With this token, you can live a dream and be what you want to be in the game room at Connecticut Golfland. With the drop of this token, you can travel the universe, race the Grand Prix, or play for the New York Yankees. You can live out your fantasies in the game room at Connecticut Golfland. A cup of tokens can provide you with hours of fun and excitement. Live out your fantasies at Connecticut Golfland, Route 83, Vernon. In the two-dimensional world of video dots and dashes, flat blips and formless blobs, one video arcade game soars a dimension above the rest. Zaxxon. Experience the control as you climb and dive. Feel the power as you attack and evade. Discover a new level of excitement with the true feel of action in three dimensions. Zaxxon, from the master design engineers of Sega. Out here we entertain ourselves at home, so we got an Atari video game. There's so many different games to play. We especially like Space Invaders, zapping those little devils from outer space. It's fun, but personally I think the whole idea of creatures from outer space is a little far-fetched. No other company offers you as many different video game cartridges as Atari. I'm Euphoria, your intergalactic hostess. Thank you for watching.